Hello. Welcome back to Gallery C. Air hugs. I'm Charlene Newsom. Today, we are hanging a new exhibition here in the lovely Russ Edwards house. Let me give you a preview of Michael Reagan's paintings. Mike Reagan is a 74-year-old painter living in Asheville. His art training was at the University of Arkansas, earning both a BA and an MFA. He is a master watercolorist, but for his current exhibit, he used acrylics. I start my canvases with uh, the traditional layer of gesso. I sand that. Then I put a layer of paint, sand it, a layer of gesso, sand it, sand it, sand it. It then goes to my sketch of the bird, which I transfer to the canvas. The sky is painted first and then the bird. Reagan touches on the theme of conservation in some of his paintings. You can see in Falling Snow Egret and Falling Night Heron that the artist has chosen not to show you their lovely white plumes. This little bird was once almost hunted to extinction for his finery, but in these depictions, they laugh at us from high above the clouds, recovered and unafraid. Uh, when I'm starting a new painting in the Fallen series, I first start with my reference books. Uh, National Geographic is a favorite, and I find the bird I'm looking for and go from there to sketches. Audubon is another one I use. Let's take a look at this marvelous 60-inch painting titled Falling Short-Eared Owl. Michael portrays him in a crepuscular setting as these owls hunt during twilight or moonlight. They are also known to make a great spectacle of themselves to attract females. We know that some will stop at nothing to make an impression. Paintings are things I know a feeling stirred by a bird calling at twilight, the scent of wood smoke on the wind, a quiet camp by the river, the reflection of a hawk on the water, or the great stillness of the mountains, and always, always, birds falling. We hope you will come by to experience these compelling paintings and enjoy their presentation in the historic Russ Edwards House. You can also see Michael Reagan's work at gallerysea.net. Thank you and be well.